purpose of the special meeting is to give residents of Manchester the opportunity to address the board on items of concern affecting the community. And that each person will be given only one opportunity to speak. That all comments should be limited to three minutes to allow all participants the opportunity to speak. And any comments must be directed to the chair. Any resident wishing to speak come forward to the nearest microphone and clearly state your name and address and recognize and give your to a policy that it mandates that it's the board policy. You can only remove your hat before you speak in this chamber. And what, what did, are the repercussions of I don't remove my hat? You won't be allowed to speak if you remove your hat. You can speak. Yeah. Well, all right, I'll do so for now. Thank you very much. I value, I want to, uh, this is less of an issue than, than what we're here for today. Um, I was one of the eight people arrested on Saturday. I'd like to say that uh, I know myself and all everybody else that was there. I did not see anybody harm any personal property. I did not see any reason why anybody should have been arrested or their property be seized right now. My camera, two of my cameras and my cell phone have been stolen by the Manchester PD. I've gone, I was told I could pick it on Monday. I went there Monday. They told me to come back Tuesday. I went there Tuesday. They told me to come back Friday. So I just like to say, I mean, we're, we're all, I think, all working for the same thing. We want to live in a peaceful and prosperous society, you know, that's safe. And then what, the question is then, how do we best get there? And right now, the, 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 at least what I've seen from the Manchester Police Department, the individuals that I've interacted with, there's some good people there that, that uh, you know, on an individual level seem, seem to know what's going on. But some other folks um, far exceed, um, they, they have, uh, engage in actions that would, that would be considered wrong for you or me to engage in. They don't have any extra rights because they have badges. I want to remind you guys that. They don't have any extra rights because they have badges. Uh, what happened on Saturday was, was ridiculous. It was, uh, it was just pure harassment. We were out there for good reason. There were some uh, major rights violations that happened to Manchester area residents the past few weeks that uh, the Attorney General, for whatever reason, decided to just not uh, go after. Uh, only underscoring uh, the fact why we were there and, and what happened to us, um, you know, just helped to prove our point. We, we did not intend, I did not intend for anybody to be arrested myself, especially yet. Uh, it was supposed to be a peaceful protest. It was peaceful. The people uh, that were initiating violence that day all had Manchester Police Department badges on. So this looks really bad for your guys, especially if, uh, in, in times of budget crises. Uh, how much money is being spent to lock, lock up? myself and, and my peaceful friends uh, to steal our property. Um, I'd ask you guys to think about that. I, I'm under no illusion that, you know, much is going to happen, but I would hope that you guys would think about uh, your actions. And, and if you guys allow for these, these sorts of things to continue happening, you guys are just as culpable. So that's all I, I'd like to say. Adamo Freeman. 